let's say I'm making a presentation and I want to take some screenshots of my graphics area. Well, before I do that, maybe I want to get rid of the graphics toolbar and also I don't want to see this text in the lower left hand corner. If I go to File Options under Window Settings, there is a drop down list so you can control the settings for the graphics toolbar. For example, maybe I want to show it in the status bar down at the bottom of the screen instead of having it in the graphics area. Or you could even choose Do Not Show if you don't want to see it entirely. And for this text in the lower left hand corner, unfortunately there's no button that you could use to turn it off, but what you can do is if you go under system appearance and then expand graphics the color of this text is controlled by the secondary highlight so if I go and change it to the same color as my graphics area which in this case is white I'm just gonna take the RGB all the way up to 255 and then click OK out of here hey no more text in the lower left hand corner and I don't have my in graphics toolbar so now I could go ahead and make my screenshots. My screen is really cluttered right now and if I hover my mouse over the model you can see that different entities are high highlighting. Surfaces or edges, even vertices and datum planes, coordinate systems. And that's because starting in Creo 4.0 the default for selection is geometry base and so it's just hard for me to get what I really want to pick. So in order to facilitate my selection, I can go to File, Options, and then choose Selection. And then I can create my own custom filter. For example, maybe I only want to be able to pick surfaces and datum planes. Add those to my filter, click OK. Then from the filter, I can choose my filter. And then when I move my mouse over the model, the only things that are highlighting for me to pick are surfaces and datum planes. Configuration options are a great way of getting Creole Parametric to look and behave the way that you want it to. But if you're like me, if you go to File Options Configuration Editor, you might have a lot of different options that you set. And there are a few options that you might want to change on a regular basis. So what you can do is you can add those frequently utilized configuration options to your favorites so that you can access them quickly and easily. For example, three that I might want to have are copy geometry method, add that to my favorites. Also, step export format. I'm going to add that one to my favorites. And the other one that I change very frequently, comp assemble start. There it is. Okay. Add to favorites. And now when I go to the favorites tab, I have those options available to me. And that way I can quickly and easily change. Hey, maybe for comp assemble start, I want to move then place. Click OK. I'm not going to save that in my settings file. But... That way, whenever I want to go to those frequently changed configuration options, they're right in my favorites.